what's up guys? How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are all having a really good day today. So today I'm going to be doing a collective haul. It's completely random, but some stuff that I picked up from Victoria's Secret, or I ordered off their website, I should say. Um, some stuff I picked up from Walgreens, Kohl's, and two things from Amazon. But you know how it is. You got one thing here, one thing there. You can't really do a haul on its own, so I decided just to go ahead and throw it all together and do a collective haul for you guys. So first off, I'm going to show you guys some stuff that I picked up from Victoria's Secret. Um, this I got after the holidays with all of the kind of sales that they were having going on. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that I picked up were these pajamas. And they're just sil uh, silver here, black, um, long pants like that. And there's a thread on there. but And then it says, or it's just got a um, silver glitter here. So those are the bottoms. And then... This is the tank top that came with it, and I think these were like $20, and this is um, like silver glitter on there, I don't know if you can see that, and then on the back it kind of crosses, it's one of those um, work crosses on the back, it's kind of hard to show unless you have it on, but it's super cute for $20 I thought, and they're very comfortable, um, they do, this is, this is a size medium, I think they kind of run a little bit large though, just to let you know, but I think after washing and stuff like that, um, I'll probably fit really nicely so and then they threw in a couple of samples I guess the Victoria's Secret bombshell because I ordered offline they sent me that and then they also sent me a sample of the uh for forbidden sample there so that was kind of nice they included that in next thing I got this was regular $30 it says it's $188 value this I ended up getting for like $10 and I thought this was kind of cool um, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this for myself. I know I always say that, but I've got so much stuff that, but I just couldn't pass it up for the deal. Although I ordered this offline and I wasn't quite sure how it was going to be. So, but this is what it is. It's a makeup set. And I don't know if I said this already, but it was like $10, but you get, um, all these eyeshadows up here and then the blushes, two lip glosses, and then eyeliner. Now this here comes out here, um, so that you can put like, you know, one of these eyeshadow, the four eyeshadows, and then the blush in there. You can also fit, I believe, a lipstick and then an eyeliner in there, too. I'll take it out and kind of show you, but it has a mirror on it, so I don't know. And um, this just kind of shows you um, different looks, I think, that you can do with it. So I thought for $10, this would make a great gift for somebody, but also, too, I might keep for myself because it might be kind of nice to have that just to kind of throw in my purse because it has this little um, compact type thing here. So, and sorry about all the glares that you're seeing there. But yeah, there is that. So, let's see if I can take this out of here without messing this up too completely here. Okay, sorry guys. Just wanted to put that out of the way and I got a hair there. So this is the compact thing here. It just says Victoria's Secret and then, yeah, you can put, um, the two eyeliners and a lip gloss and the eyeshadow and a blush in there basically and then the brush in there too but I won't open it up and show you just because the mirror's in there. So this is really nice. I um, thought that was a really good deal. The last thing I got from Victoria's Secret and I'm going to show it to you guys um, is I ordered a sport bra and I normally don't show things like this but I wanted to. I'm starting to get healthier and get on track and I wanted to show you guys. I ordered some other stuff but I won't show you that. So if you don't like seeing sport bras just fast forward through this part here because I don't, I know some people get offended by that, but actually the only reason why I heard about the Victoria's Secret is from watching a YouTube video. So I thought I would show it to you guys because they're actually really nice. I'm quite surprised by it. And I got this on their clearance for $20. So just fast forward this part if it offends you and I'm sorry if it does, but so this is what it looks like. These are really durable. Um, and it just says Victoria's Secret and it's got the zipper here and it just totally unzips. But the thing about it is and this is the strap on the back here. These are a really nice quality. If you're working out and you really need a nice, um, I went through different styles of sports bras and I won't show that too long just because, but I went through a lot of different styles of sports bras and I have never found one that I've just been totally, um, you know, excited about, I guess. So I'm anxious to give this one a try and for finding it on the clearance for $20 because I think some of the other ones ran about $50 or something like that. That one might've been 25, I can't remember, 20, $25. So I thought it would be kind of cool to try it out and see, um, since I'm getting back into the whole working out thing, I really wanted to have a nice um, sport bra. So so that's all I got at Victoria's Secret. Now I'm going to show you guys what I ordered off of Amazon. So um, the first thing I ordered off of Amazon was this movie here. And this, um, like I said, this haul is totally random. 
It's the Walt Disney The Parent Trap 2 movie collection. It's The Parent Trap 1 The Parent Trap 2. Now this movie is the movie that I actually was my favorite movie when I was a um, little girl. I didn't even realize they made a Parent Trap 2. I saw the original uh, The Parent Trap 1. This was my favorite movie growing up and I just, I haven't watched it for such a long time, but I just had one of those moments where I was like, I've got to get this and I guess I just need to watch it because I miss it. And then now I want to see The Parent Trap 2, although now I'm looking at it from the back and it looks like they have different, um, you know, they have different people that play in the movie. So I hate it when they do that, though. I mean, is that just me? I don't know. I just like to have, you know, like, um, you know, like how they did that with Home Alone. They have different characters or whatever. It just doesn't feel the same after that. So I don't know. We'll see how that is. But I definitely, um, I had to get the this here so I could be reminded of my childhood, I guess. So I was excited to get that. Also from Amazon, I ordered this, um, I don't know who this brand is or what, and I don't even know how I found it, but it's this cute lace. It's by Jay Thompson, and this was, um, this was $16. It was like the one of the last ones on Amazon, I guess. It's a little sheer than what I like, but it's a peplum style top, which I'm in love with peplum tops, and I, I tend to wear a lot of whites, creams, and... I don't know. Those are my favorite colors, lighter colors, especially for the summer. And I got this for the summertime. So, but it's this really cute lace, um, design here. This got the straps here, but like I said, you're going to have to wear, I'm going to have to wear like a cami underneath it. And then it's just really flowy down here. Um, with the white, um, like that, but this is going to be super cute on. I'm, I really love in the style. I just, the only downfall is it is it is sheer. So, um, but I love that. I think it's so cute and I'm definitely going to be wearing that in the summertime. So that is all I got from Amazon. Now quickly I'm going to show you what I got from Kohl's and then we'll go to, um, Walgreens. The reason why I'm doing Walgreens last is because I want to swatch some of the lip stuff and some of the stuff's white and I don't want it all over that. So that's why I'm doing it this way. So the first thing that I got from Kohl's was I got six of these towels and I'm only going to show you a few of them. I got them on their clearance and I really love this design. These were, I ordered these offline and they were regular what? Regular $15.99 it says. These are the Sonoma brand. Yeah, the Sonoma brands. This is upside down, I'm sorry. Um, let me just show you one, but as you can see, it was regular $15.99, but I got this after, I got a special discount after the holidays where you get extra 20% off or something like that. And so these made these, I, I wanna say around $6, but I really love this design here. I love this pattern, and um, these are really nice quality. The way they feel, they're, they feel really nice. And when you flip it over on this side, it's like that, and then that's like that. I just love this design, and um, this massive matches masses. This masses. This matches <laughs> one of our bathrooms. So yeah, I got six of those. I'm not going to show you all of them, but I just love this. So I was excited to get that for a good deal. And also going along with that, I got this. Um, this is the box here, but these were on clearance for three dollars, and these are called. These are wax milks, basically. It comes with this keepsake box. But yeah, these were $3, and you get um, one, two, three, four. You get four different packages. And let me see if I can open this um, of the wax melts here. This doesn't tell me the brand. I don't know if this is the Sonoma brand or what. I just found this in their clearance selection. In fact, I didn't realize it was that reasonable. I'm probably going to go back and get more because I didn't realize how well these smell. I didn't even smell. I just buy things when it's on clearance. I don't know. But they smell so amazing. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's apple cinnamon swirl comes in it with it. And then it also came with um, this one here. It's called Ginger Snap. One of them just, oh, they all just smell amazing. There's not one that smells bad, to be honest with you. Oh my God. It just smells so freaking good. And then there's frosted sugar cookies. I just want to smell them all. They smell so good. And this is how many of the cubes you get in there. So, and the last one that came in that set was this one here and it's vanilla pumpkin cream. And this one was honestly my favorite. Yeah, this one is my favorite. Oh my gosh. I cannot describe this. It does not smell like your traditional like pumpkin pie or something. This just has a really nice scent to it and I love it. So yeah, I'm definitely going to go back and get some more of those. Um, they'd be great for gifts, but I love the box and the fact that it matches that towel set. So I'll probably use that somehow in our, in our bathroom or whatever. And then since I'm all in this whole workout thing and I've been doing pretty good so far, I'm excited. I'm just going to start doing the videos like had had talked about before on Friday. It's probably like Friday fit day. I don't know if I'm going to start this Friday or next Friday. I haven't decided yet. But I picked up these Fila pants and these were regular $45. Um, 
And these are just some workout pants that, um, and they're just the regular long, and then they flare down here. But I'm really liking the quality of their very nice, did I say so already? They're regular 45, but these were after all the extra 20% off you put on your Kohl's card. Um, these ended up being like $25. But I think it's definitely worth it. The quality is very nice. And I've had Fila ones before, and I really like them. So I went ahead and got um, them again. And then the last thing I picked up from Kohl's to go along with the whole workout, and this is for like days when I'm running outside. I have a treadmill and stuff inside, but sometimes I like to run outside when it's colder. Um, I might do that too. I picked up this little Fila coat to go along with it, and it's got, it says Fila. I'm hoping you can see that there. Um, like Fila on these little strings here, and then it's got this nice collar, but then it's also got the hoodie. And it's a fitted sweatshirt. Um, it's got this kind of, what do you call that? Like down, I guess, maybe style? I don't know, it's not real poofy. It's not extremely thick either, and it's kind of, it's got a really nice feel to it. But I just really like it, and I think it's gonna go well with the, um, and I'm hoping you can see Sometimes it's so hard to show stuff on camera as far as clothes go, but I really like that as well. So now that is all I got from Kohl's. Now I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I picked up from Walgreens. So Walgreens had some of their stuff 50% off. And now I know some people have been talking about finding these Revos for like 50 cents or something like that, I think. Now my Walgreens, they didn't have these for 50 cents, but they did have them. They were half off. These were like regular $2.99. So I went ahead and got these. I think this was $1.50. And this one here, I didn't have this one, so I got this one here. There's that one. This one is the, um, let's see here. This one is the Red Velvet Cupcake. So, yeah, got that one. So it was $1.50. Still think that's a really good deal at the half off. And then I picked up this one because I didn't have this one. This is I got this one in the Gingerbread Latte. There was only other and one that I didn't have, but they didn't have it, and it was the purple. And I think that was like Sugar Plum or something like that, wasn't it? I don't know. So I got those. The next thing I found is they had a new display of some Wet n Wild stuff. So I picked up this nail polish that I didn't have. And this was 99 cents. And I don't see a color on it. I don't know. I think it says Ultraviolet. But it's just a really pretty purple color. I really liked that. So I got that. And that was, nine. I don't know. Did I say that already? But it was 99 cents. So I got that. Next thing I got were these uh, Milani eyeshadows. And these... These were like three something. The first one I got, and they didn't have a lot of these left at my Walgreens. I've been looking for these for a long time and finally found it. The first one I got was this one in number 21, and it's Bella Teal. Love this color. I love that. I think it's gorgeous. It's a really gorgeous teal color. Next one I got was this one here, and it's Bella Navy. And this is just a real pretty navy color. And I'm hoping because this sunlight is starting to kind of go down now. But it's a real pretty navy color, and that's about all they had. There's some other colors I would like to get, but that's all that my Walgreens really had. So now I'm going to show you guys a couple of lip products that I picked up. The first one I got was this lipstick here, and this is in um, this is Maybelline number no. seven two five, and it's Lilac uh, Flush. Oh, did I show this already? So this is with the packaging. Sorry guys, that's the train. If you can hear that, but so that's the packaging, and then this really gorgeous lilac color. It's absolutely gorgeous and I'll go ahead and try to swatch it on here and hopefully you can see it. I love this color. It's gorgeous. So this is the color here. It's a real pretty just gorgeous lilac color. Let's see if I can get my light here. Sorry about it getting darker but that is gorgeous I think. So I got that and then I also picked up this one. This is number 501. It's a Wet n Wild, and it's called A Short Affair. And I found that this in 99 cents as well with the um, new fingernail polish that I found. So I got that, and this is just a real pretty nude kind of mauve color. And this one doesn't show up very well on my skin tone because it's almost like that's my skin tone, but it will show up on my lips um, pretty well. It's a real pretty uh, neutral color. It's really, I'm sorry if you can't see it, but it blends in really well with my skin tone. So... But I love this color. It's gorgeous. Um, okay, the last lip product that I got was this CoverGirl. Um, and this is one of their... What is this color? Oh, gosh. Of course, I took off this sticker off that. Let me see if I can see this. Oh, gosh. It's one of their new lip glosses. And... Oh, here it is at the top. And it's number 630, Colorishes. Colorishes. 
I think. <laughs> so this is what it looks like here. This almost reminds me of one of the NARS lip gloss. I'm going to have to go look and see if I have... This looks almost like identical. It's got that gold shimmer and I can't remember what lipstick or lip gloss this from is like NARS and I should have probably went through my lip glosses to see. It's a little bit different. This is what the... But it's got that gold um, peach kind of shimmer. I'm trying to think of what it was. Oh gosh, which lip gloss? This is gorgeous too. It's real um, corally kind of pink with gold flecks in it is the best I can describe it. And this blends really well with my skin tone too. So I'm not sure that's going to show either. This is what it looks like here. I kind of have a peachy pinky skin tone. So everything kind of blends. But um, this is a really gorgeous color. So this is part of their new lip glosses. They had a lot of pretty colors to choose from as far as that goes. So anyways, that is my haul. I'm sorry it was a little long and sorry it was a little kind of random and all put together, but I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys all have a good rest of your day. And of course, I thank you guys for watching. Bye guys.